Hi, welcome to Vanita Shree's Kitchen. Today here I am with a refreshing spicy fish fillet curry. I have taken tilapia fillets for this recipe, but any boneless fish would work for this recipe. I have cleaned and chopped 3 fillets into small cube sizes. The preparation is of two steps. The first step is the marination of the fish fillets. In a bowl add 1 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste, quarter teaspoon of turmeric powder, half teaspoon of red chili powder and 1 tablespoon of corn flour, required amount of salt and add some water and make this as a smooth paste. Now add the fillets and apply the marinade evenly on the fish. Always make the marinade separately instead of adding the spices directly on the fish so that you can check for the salt and spice taste and adjust it accordingly. Set this mixture aside for 10 minutes. Now heat oil in a pan and add the fish pieces one by one and let the fish pieces cook on one side. Now flip gently and fry the other side. Remove the fish when it is done three by four, as it will be further cooked in the curry. Set the fried pieces aside. Now we are moving to the step two, that is the preparation of the curry. Heat three tablespoon of sesame or gingerly oil in a pan. Add half a teaspoon of mustard seeds, half a teaspoon of fenugreek or methi seeds, one teaspoon of fennel seeds, and allow them to crackle. Add one chopped red chili into it. Now add one teaspoon of ginger garlic paste and saute this mixture well till the raw smell goes. Now add one chopped medium size onion, two chopped green chilies, and some fresh coriander leaves. And saute this mixture till the onions becomes transparent. Add some chopped green and yellow capsicum pieces and saute well. Now add one teaspoon of red chili powder, two teaspoon of fennel and cumin powder, a pinch of turmeric powder, desired amount of salt, and saute this mixture until the raw smell of the spices goes. At this stage, add a tomato puree made out of two large tomatoes and saute this mixture well. Let the mixture boil for about two minutes. You can adjust the gravy consistency by adding a required amount of water to it. Cover the pan and let the gravy boil till it becomes thickened. The oil got separated and it indicates that the curry is done. And now it's the best time to add the fried pieces, fish pieces one by one into the gravy. and allow the gravy to boil for a minute finally add 1 teaspoon of soy sauce and allow the curry to boil for 30 seconds garnish the gravy with fresh coriander leaves and that's it the spicy super flavorful tilapia fish fillet curry is ready to serve i post recipes every tuesday thursday and saturday please hit the notification bell icon to see my next recipe as it comes out This curry is one of the best curry to make the kids eat fish. Please try this recipe at your home and post your valuable comments to Vanita Shree's Kitchen. Like and subscribe to Vanita Shree's Kitchen for more interesting recipes. Thanks for watching and bye bye.